Before you begin, you'll need to turn your power off at the circuit breaker. Confirm the power is off by flipping the switch you're going to replace on and off. Typically, you'll need a Phillips head screwdriver and a pair of pliers to do the job. First, unscrew your existing switch. A single pole switch usually has three connections, a wire from the circuit breaker, a wire that goes to the light, and a ground wire. It's possible you may not have a ground wire in the wall box. However, if you're installing a motion sensor, you'll need a ground in order for it to operate properly. If you don't have a ground wire in this location, you might be able to use the sensor in another location in your home. If you're not installing a motion sensor, then you don't need a ground connection. In this video, we are using a Maestro sensor switch. However, these instructions apply to all other products that have the same color wires. Connect the ground wire to the green and bare wires on your new control using a wire cap. Next, connect the two remaining wires from the old switch to the two black wires on the new control. It doesn't matter which black wire you choose, because they're interchangeable. Finally, place a wire cap on the blue wire. You don't need to use this wire in a single pole application. Screw the control back into the wall and add the wall plate. Turn the power back on at the breaker. 